finals uh, between P and Ocean himself. So we'll get to see uh, see who he plays in just a second. What is that Inkling? A sim look. It looks like Inkling. he's hovering. I don't think he's selected Inkling yet. If he did, though, that's exciting to see. All right, they were given the okay to start. Okay, so it is Inkling versus Snake. Now, this is a matchup I'm a fan of actually for Inkling. I feel like uh, against Snake, grab combos are very good if you have true combos. Inkling's very What's good at What's the Booyah window? It's a pretty big window because of Snake's weight. Um, is, he to, is he able to grenade in between it or no? No. Oh, no, wow. he can't. But the other thing that makes this matchup impossible or very difficult for Snake is Inkling's neutral beam. Oh, okay. Uh, because of the like 1% each hit does, it detonates the grenade on contact. Okay. So Snake gets stuck in shield for pulling grenade. Oh, wow. And then it's a free grab for this place. Oh, key what you can have that one back. Ocean taking a really good commanding lead right now. We're gonna stop side. Let's see if Snake can turn it around. If there's any care that can do it, it will be Snake. How is Ledge trapping this matchup for Snake? Does, um, Inkling, Snake? Get off, does Inkling get off the stage pretty easily versus uh, Snake? Or? The up smash can be kind of difficult for Inkling to get around um, because they don't have like a disjoint forward up air to deal with it. Mm -hmm. um, but Inkling kind of a slippery character, they can sneak in and out. But the up tilt for Snake gonna just even this game right up. I'm liking these little grenade, his little B reverse and his grenade placement. His grenade plays really good right now. Yeah, it can be yeah. very difficult to actually track down Snake when he's yeah. camping in the air like that. Because yeah, he's uh, doing it really well. He's not just grounded. He's like moving. He's very mobile with this. It was really good. Yeah. And that was actually oh. a really good up air from Ocean. He only got the second hit of it because the first hit would have detonated the grenade. But he spaced it appropriately, so he only got the hit that mattered and did the grenade. Yeah, I always get a mix up between the Nair and upper animation of Inkling. <laughs> yeah, uh, Nair is the fast little spin that they do. Up air is two hits above them. Okay. All right. So much coverage right there between the grenade, the mortar, and the down smash. There was nowhere for Ocean look, to go. Wow, look how fast he just turned this. I mean, it's still even game right now, but he's able to net his dodge. There you Spot go. Dodge up tilt. And that was just unfortunate for Ocean. He had yeah. the uh, read on the getup with the down tilt uh, because he's really good for catching neutral get up spot dodge, but he did it in the wrong direction, and that's a free punish. Yeah, okay, look at Key. He was uh, playing around with a few other characters like Terry and Ken. Looks like he's back to his tried and true snake. Yeah, I know he's also been playing a little bit of hero. Oh, hero, yeah. It's, he's doing like really well. Like after the first stock, you look like Ocean Reality, like, but then he just quickly turned it around and took really control of it. Ooh, oh, nice yeah, more read. Oh, that was a so really yeah, that solid was a, stuff. That was a really fast. I, that was a really fast game. Key really just punished, reacted on every time he touched Ocean. I say feel maybe Ocean should pick. I mean, when he does the combo, I think like. Ink, oh, well, I feel in this game a lot of characters are really good at at the 0% getting their mix-ups and strings at the beginning. But I kind of feel like if Ocean's able to, like, do those mix-ups. Oh, okay, actually, it's Pokemon Trainer now. Yeah. But even so, same thing. After he gets done combling uh, the Snake, he wants to, like, retreat, pick his spots, and then go back in again. Because if you kind of overcommit against Snake, he's going to make you punish, uh, pay for it by a lot. Yeah, exactly. I feel like I kind of like the Switch just because uh, Pokemon Trainer is has so many tools to deal with Snake. The Sword is going to be very similar to the yeah. uh, Inkling was, where it's going to be a very small character, weave in and out and get a lot of damage. But then he's able to switch to the Ivysaur and kind of match some of Snake's camp he play. Yeah. Uh, and as well as giant hitboxes on things like down air, makes it really difficult for Snake to recover. Yeah, I think on... Okay. I can see right now, like, this is how the last game kind of started, you've seen, but he didn't take the first stock yet. I gotta see. Oh, oh he, he'll take it. He'll take it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so start so with two stocks. It looked it, like mm. Key stuck the C4 yeah. onto Ocean, but Ocean kind of kept it close enough where he was able to at least yeah. hit Key with it as well. Yeah, it's like whenever Ocean get things started, it's like grenades just interrupt and stops his whole momentum of whatever he's trying to do. Yeah, I feel like I yeah. want to see Ocean swap off the Squirtle at this point and mm. put stuff in the bad position there. Let's see if Key will capitalize off this. Yeah, he no re-grab invincibility means he's going to get poked by that grenade. Okay. That's a really good nail, but he gets the cross up. He doing really, he's just tacking on damage everywhere he can with grenades, poking at him. And then it's, I don't want to say, I don't feel like Ocean is playing bad. It's just that every time he gets in, like a grenade or anything interrupts him and he's not getting the conversions off. Like yeah. he, he was like, that was a good DI by Key with the back air into the up Ooh. Ooh, nice. Another up tilt, that's yeah. four, I believe, for Key this game, or this These set. games are going really fast. I mean, I would like to see if uh, Ocean would slow it down to see what Snake is doing, but I mean, he's doing he, he's doing well. Yeah, now this is where it's going to matter. Yeah. Immediate down air on the immediate up beam. Nowhere for They're Key to go. They're exchanging stocks back and forth, so it's really good to watch. 
Yeah, and that's what I was talking about is Ivysaur is going to be so capable of edge guarding uh, mm, Snake. That. Ooh, look at that. That was so clean. The mix ups and reads, the string. Uh, there you go. Ooh, I like the back end to yeah, the up right there. Like he could have, Ivysaur could have protected on so much damage, but he really, like I said, stopping his Momoa. Good up tilt. Another up tilt. Another up tilt. Good game by Key. Key. Really taking control of the rest of the first I believe he got five out of the six stocks with that 